my life. And I was like, what is this thing that I could be doing, that I would be good at, but I'm not doing it? And I think it really got me thinking. It's like, when I was a kid, this may surprise you, but it probably won't. I dedicated myself to musical theater. And I did that until I realized that that wasn't happening. And then I switched to improv, and now I still do that, and then I do this. But then I was like, did I make some wrong steps? Basically, this is what I'm saying. Could I be a professional athlete right now? <laughs> Sucks, but it's like, I don't think 
just Monopoly should be the game that gets everyone's irritation because all games are bad. Like, I don't, I don't even know what Bananagrams is. And then whoever, and, and for years, everyone's like, let's play this. And I'm like, I don't know what it is. So, and I've never learned. It just, it looks too much like a banana for me to want to play it. And then, and then, the man, even though it was filled with anger, I'm not going to say that it's untrue. There are things in my life I would like to change. For example, for the past, if I could give it a ballpark estimate, eight years, I've been wanting to be more spontaneous. Who in this room would consider themselves a spontaneous person? Okay, so besides for three brave people, everyone here is like me, which you're not spontaneous, you are consistent. Consistent is the opposite of spontaneous. It's on YouTube. Oh my God, this is a totally different reaction than the last question. Everyone's like, me, I do, I do too. You know, it's weird when YouTube recommends things for you because sometimes YouTube is like spot on. And the other times you're like, how, why am I being recommended this? This doesn't make sense. This is basically what happened to me. Um, about two weeks ago, YouTube recommended this video of how to apply foundation. And I don't wear makeup, but I was like, you know what? I'm gonna hear what this woman has to say because this is a, this is a skill that I think you should know. And I think that's why YouTube recommended it to me. They're like, you should know this. So, all right. Good. I clicked on the video and the woman in the video was showing you how to apply foundation, but she wasn't doing it on her own face. She was using a potato. So she was applying the foundation to the potato and then she applied lipstick on the potato. She was showing you how to do these different like contouring things with all these different types of makeup. I don't ever wear makeup. I haven't I had to wear it when I used to do musical theater, which is another story, but I haven't worn it since then and it's been years. And then, so I was watching this video and I started feeling really like down and out about it because I have low self-esteem. Um, and I'm like, I would never stand in front of a group of people that are mostly strangers and say that I'm uglier than a potato. <laughs> but am I uglier than a potato with makeup on? I, am, I don't know, I don't know. And, and I wouldn't ever ask you to rate me against a potato with makeup on. But if I were to do that right now, what do y'all think? The verdict's still out. Someone is, what? You know what? The verdict is still 